the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God, Amen. Today I will tell you how the simple faith can take us to heaven easily. Because we are very complicated. I'm so sorry to say that. I'm with you. In this new generation, we keep thinking and thinking. And we are very complicated. Our, our minds became like a hard drive that it's already lost. I keep thinking, analyzing, believe not, but look at this guy. A girl went to Abuna and said to him, Abuna, Abuna, my dad is sick and he cannot move from uh, his bed. Abuna said, okay, I'll come and visit him and pray for him. So, uh, father, when he found uh, time, he went to visit that family. And he went to the man in his room, he found beside him uh, an empty chair. And he said, you know that I'm coming and you prepared for me the, the chair? He said, no, Abuna, I'm so sorry. This chair has to be like that, stay without anybody. But I will get you another chair. And he asked his daughter to bring him uh, Abuna chair. So after Abuna said, he said to him, can you close the door, Abuna, because I want to tell you about the story about this chair, empty chair or seat. He said to him, look, I was, after I became paralyzed and I couldn't move from my bed, I felt so bad. I felt so, so bad that I felt pain. I felt that I'm forgotten, I'm forsaken. I was really upset and very depressed. One of my friends came to visit me and said to me, why you are depressed? He said, because look at my life now. He said to him, look, I have a solution for that. Whenever you feel pain, talk to Jesus Christ. Whenever you, you feel lonely, talk to him. I said, talk to Jesus. He said, yeah, he will listen to you. He will hear your voice and he will help you. And he will feel also your feelings. So just talk to him. He said, okay. And uh, then I kept talking to Jesus from day after day after day. Then I said, okay, I don't want Jesus to be standing. So he put a chair and said, Jesus, can you sit here? And I'll keep talking with you. And I kept talking with him all my life since I became paralyzed. I keep talking to him about everything. My happiness, my sorrow, my pain, everything. And since then, I feel Jesus is there listening to me. And I feel his presence on this chair. So I keep this chair all the time to see Jesus on the chair. So Abuna was so happy to hear that. And he went very comfort that man is believing in a very simple faith that Jesus is listening to him and he is sitting beside his bed. After a while, the girl went to Abuna and said to him, my dad went to heaven. He said, wow, he was a very good person, my daughter. How is your life? She said, I'm, I'm good, Abuna, I'm comfort because I'm sure that God um, took my dad into heaven. He was a very a saintly man. But there is something very strange happened before his death, that he asked me to come and he hugged me and kept saying to me that he loved me so, so much and uh, uh, he will take care of me and stuff like that. After I went to buy some stuff, I came back, I found him already uh, dead. But I found half of his body on the, uh, on the bed and the other half on the chair, empty chair beside him. I said to her, yes, I know why. Because your dad felt that Jesus Christ always there, sitting on the chair beside him. So he had to, at the last moment in his life, he put his head on the um, lap of Jesus Christ to go with him. Do you feel that Jesus really with you and the, and the bus while you are riding your car, while he's beside you in every time you spend, every time you go everywhere? Uh, do you feel that he is always, there is no any gap between you and him? You follow him and he's following you? Do you talk to him in every work you do? In, uh, at the kitchen while you are cooking? 
you feel that he is there you you feel that while you are talking to your baby that Jesus is there and you are talking to Jesus through your baby you see him everywhere either in the in the bench of the in, uh, in the desk in, in your college Jesus everywhere what you need is just to talk to him we talk with everyone but when it comes to God we don't talk to him we need to learn how to talk to Jesus tell him about anything everything the good and the bad imagine that you can say to him Lord you know I smell bad yeah anything he's not away from you he's in you and he knows all the feelings you have so you can tell him Lord have you seen my friend did so and so I feel so sorry for that I feel so bad uh, I feel anything any feelings and he would react rightly with you and he will teach you everything because if you keep talking with him he will talk to you also he loves you so much just stick to his love may the Lord God make us love him as he loved us glory be to God forever and ever amen